What is up, YouTubers? It's Mushroom again, and I have a very, very exciting, exciting, important thing to show you. Um, the other night I was at, uh, this is a, a nine pack that I got at, um, Walmart. Now, all of these you've seen already, the black, uh, the black, uh, Ranchero, the white SP2, the orange, uh, Chevelle. This one actually has a paint issue, but have you seen this? The Ford, uh, I believe this is a Falcon. I could be wrong, but, but it's done in like, kind of like a gray, uh, flat gray. And that's pretty awesome. Um, previously it was only released in blue and in white, but here it is. So, but that's not really the one I wanted to show you. That's just one of the new cars. This is the one that I wanted to show you. Um, this I got at Target, which quickly sold out. There's no more available at Target, so uh, if you find one, you you found one, and that's awesome. Um, this one has the Plymouth Roadrunner in it, in a like a fire bright red um, with some really basic tempos, which I I think is awesome. Um, and then we have the uh, I believe this is the Chevelle. Uh, I could be wrong, but in, in a different colorway. And then you've seen these cars already. Um, this is also a new one. Uh, now, I don't know if this one and this one, um, or this one and this one, are going to be released in the upcoming H case. But uh, just to give you an idea, there's this. Now, the one that I'm going to open for you right now, that I think is the most important one, and I don't think it's going to be in the H case. I think it's going to be in the JH. I or the J case. Remember, I said I or the J case. This is just a prediction, so if it comes true, give me a thumbs up. If it doesn't come true, I'm sorry. Um, this is pu purely just uh, speculation and a guess. But here we go with another 9-pack from Target. Um, we have that car. We have the uh, S2000 and the Evasive. Thanks, everybody, for pointing that out to me. Um, Twin Duction, which is an old casting, old color. Um, we have the Ford Shelby and Mustang, and then we have the SP2 Volkswagen, but this is the one I wanted to show you guys the most, and that is the gray silver Falcon Cuda. This is the AAR Cuda, but this time it's in silver with blue tempos. Um, I have not seen this. I, this just came out too. So I'm, I want to say that this is not going to be in the H case. It'll be in the I or the J case. So Target's getting cars that are already going to be two cases ahead in these nine packs, which is pretty crazy. So, um, and as promised, I am going to open this bad boy up. So let's check this out. Man. Uh. So let's start from the exclusive car. And that's the first and foremost. And this is the 1970 Chevy Roadrunner. Um, it's got a tiny little Roadrunner right there. It's, I mean, I'm sorry. <laughs> Did I say Chevy? I am at the Plymouth Roadrunner. Sorry, guys. I'm kind of excited about the one car that I just spoke to you about. Um, this has some great, great tempos. And uh, just a basic red, fire engine red paint job. Thank God. God, we have a black interior. I wish we had a black base, but at least one out of two is better than zero. Um, and here's that first car. The second car I'm going to do up close and personal is the S2000 Evasive version. Um, it's got the yellow wheels. Uh, this is a beautiful, beautiful casting. Thankfully, we got a dark silver interior. And guess what? A black base. Thank you, Hot Wheels. Um, the bright yellow wheels, I'm not feeling too much, but hey, you know, you gave me one thing, and that's the dark interior. You didn't give me taillights, but, you know, I guess one out of three, or two out of three is better, or two out of four. Anyways, um, next one up is the, the strangely popular um, Volkswagen SP2. Uh, this is a unique little casting. It reminds me of the uh, Scirocco, one of my favorite Volkswagens uh, of all time. And um, it's not a Scirocco, but it definitely reminds me of. And strangely, this is actually a very sought after car. So uh, no tail lights, uh, of course. And uh, we got a very cool, cool body. So there's 
replace that. Um, now we have the, what is this, the 2012 um, 68 Shelby GT500. Now, there is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful car. I, I mistakenly thought that this was already, uh, this was going to be, um, I mean, I think, I thought this was already out. This, I think, is a new color variant. Um, we have a black interior. Thank you, Hot Wheels. We have a dark base, which, not black, but hey, way better than chrome or silver or, you know, whatever weird colors they come up with. Um, and yeah, this is an overall awesome, awesome casting. And I'm glad it is in this pack. Uh, twin duction. Now, as you know, there are two versions. One that has the, the Zamac, um, model here. And this is actually not it. Um, the Zamac is actually separated and this is actually part of the casting. So this is the newer, ver uh, newer version or, uh, retooling and you know again I'm not really fond of the fantasy cars but that's that let's go straight into the uh, Triumph TR6 I don't know I, I want to say I've seen this before so I'm not going to say this is coming out soon if this is a new color and a new very way uh, variant please comment down below and let me know okay because uh, I'm not sure um, but Still a very cool casting. Um, and we have this I do know I've seen already. And this is, I think I've seen this in 2011. And that's the Chevy Nova. And let's see, it doesn't actually say, but this is the Nova. Um, and it's awesome. <laughs> it's awesome, mean, and badass but yeah i think i've seen this green in the 2011 line so uh i'm not going to say that that's coming out or coming soon and then we have the uh pocket bikester uh this is an all metal casting has a little bike in the the uh bay, the back area has a little toolbox and an oil can or a gas can in the rear trunk um and then there we go the futuristic uh kind of interiors Again, not a fan of the future castings and whatnot, but hey, it's in the line pack and it's mine now. And the car uh, you've all been waiting for, as I have been. Uh, and the reason why I bought this line pack, uh, the silver AAR Cuda Falcon with the K&N Tampos. Um, this I have not seen yet. It has a black interior. It has lightly tinted blue, blue tinted windows. Which is very cool because it accents the blue tampos, has the Falcon tire uh, logo tampo on the t on the rear quarter panel, and of course the hood tampos, black base uh, with the white wheels. This thing is awesome, guys. So uh, prediction: either the I case or the J case, and not the H case because we just saw this come out um, recently. So, anyways. Let me know your thoughts. Um, got a bit of the tempo overspray right there. Let me know your thoughts. Tell me what you're thinking about this one particular car. I mean, you can comment on all of these cars, but I know this is the one that everybody's like going to want to get a piece of. Um, and yeah, thanks for watching and uh, give me a thumbs up. Questions and comments down below, and we'll see you. Uh, we'll see you soon. Thanks, guys. Bye bye.